Carbohydrate, dehydration synthesis. The D in dehydration, it means down or out. And the hydration means water. But when you put dehydration together, it's out. So dehydration synthesis is taking water out. And synthesis means to put together. So you're putting something together by taking water out. What is dehydration synthesis? It's when you put something together by taking water out. Now dehydration synthesis is a very specific example and the general term would be condensation. Condensation means to put together. So how does dehydration synthesis and condensation differ? Well, let's say for example, Toyota is a general term whereas Scion is a specific term of Toyota. Do you see the difference between those two? So there are many types of Toyota just as there are many types of condensation. And these two are the general terms, whereas these other ones are the specific term. So dehydration synthesis is one of the category of condensation. What is dehydration synthesis for? In carbohydrate and other macromolecules, it's for the monosaccharide combined together, two monomers making either a disaccharide or a polysaccharide. How? Well, you combine two glucose together. Now notice here there's an OH and over here there's also an OH. But once they combine together, there will only be an O. So basically, water was removed to put them together. So when they're put together, it becomes a linkage between them, which is called a glycosidic linkage. The word glyco means glucose, so it's a sugar linkage. Okay, let's do a quick review. Condensation. A specific example is dehydration synthesis. It's when you put things together by taking water out. So here we have two glucose and then the aftermath. Notice that over here the OH, OH, and then we only have an O left. That means H2O was removed. They were put together by removing water. And this link created by those two is called glycosidic linkage. Helium. What did this chemist say when he found two new isotopes of helium? Hee <laughs> hee. So if you find a new element, what would you call it? 